Hey guys, welcome back to another Jared Summer Vlog video. It's your girl Jared. Hey boy, Rob. And today we are here at the Revolution of Hip Hop Museum here in the Bronx. Yeah, like she said, man, right off the exterior in the Bronx, 149, man. Whenever you guys get a chance, don't forget to pull up. This is actually a walkthrough of hip hop history. So basically, it's gonna take you from 1986 to 1990, guys. So it's amazing. So we want you to come on this journey as we walk through hip hop. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. To the Jerry's Family Vlog. Stay tuned, guys. Let's go inside. Come on this side. So it's a three minute experience. So when you'll be ready, you can push that button and enjoy. Thank you. Three, two, one, zero, zero, and lift off. Cool. I'm tired. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm officially transported back into time. Welcome to 1986 and 1990. Oh, thank you. Hi, guys. So, look, check it out. We basically walked the farm. I don't know if you guys know, but Tiny of Hip Hop, Russell Simmons. This is his jacket from Death Jam. So, hold this camera, guys. Let's see if I can bring my screwdriver, guys. Just playing, guys. No, you can't be doing that. Some Run DMC clothes over here. Oh, this is fire. Look at this. Yo, look at that rope chain. Rope chain back in the day was some fire. Isn't that Damn, amazing, fun. guys? I got this like three of those. What you mean? <laughs> So check it out guys, they got an experience here. You can actually listen to some audio. It's like an audio of them talking about how they got on, who put them on, how they was introduced to hip hop, what influenced them. So I guess this is one of their early on interviews. So Run wow. DMC guys, check this out guys. They first cassette tape. Wow. PSN tape, video music wow. box, the interview, all one, 1986. Yo, that's fire. I ain't gonna lie, yo, I actually got something similar to this, so it made me want to go put mine on, man. I should have walked in there. <laughs> oh, classic, babe. Classic, babe. What you doing like that? <laughs> Look at the box. Hey, yeah. Easy, you ain't got nothing on those originals. Sure the don't. Sure don't. <laughs> oh, that's fire, guys. This. Look at this. So y'all know fashion and hip hop go hand in hand. So back in the days, like this is like how they would wear leather suits, matching um, outfits, leather suits. If you guys can see down below, LL leather. killing it. Hell, word, look at hey, that. Chain, guys. Hip hop has evolved so much, man. So it's amazing to see. So look at, check this out, guys. Before we had 70 inch flat screen TV. We had this. We had black and white TV that Yo. you had to like hit to get yeah. the tune in. <laughs> Yo, guys, not for nothing, but my mama used to have a TV like this in the kitchen, yo. Know? <laughs> when we was growing up, that was kids. So like they said, they got so many different like pieces of hip hop that was donated to the museum. They got pieces from Coolio that was that bike in the front we showed you. Yeah. Like we said, God, we're gonna proceed on. Check it out, it's the hip hop museum right here in the Bronx. All right, guys, they got some more stuff here. They have a lot of, you know, picture frames and Comment down below, collection. guys, if you know who these guys are, man. Hip hop pioneers. If I know Rakim, you gonna stop playing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And Eric B. <laughs> Oh, look at some of this stuff, guys. Wow. These are some of the actual backstage passes, guys, to some of the shows. Wow. Some of the pictures from back in the day's hip hop, guys. Yo, that's dope. Giving me like paid in full vibes. You guys have <laughs> ever seen paid in full? Boy, that's crazy. This is like real fire. This is like all of the boarding passes. This is like, this is actual payments 
that uh, Eric B and Rakim was getting. Yeah. They did seven shows in Chicago, uh, through the city tour of Chicago, Louisiana, Ohio, and they actually got paid out. Almost $7,000 on it. I guess hip hop was paying. I just wanted to uh, state a fact that hip hop has changed so many um, people lives, young black men, young um, Latinos, and the culture. So hip hop is a positive thing for people that can use it in their, uh, their, their voice is a powerful message. So Steph, what you got going on? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. She uh -oh. about to, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Actually, a little before my time, guys, but I'm guaranteed my brother and definitely know who Scholar Rock was. So, you see, it's a rap article there about how his life was cut short. I think that baby sham in the middle. Mr. Man, his birthday bag. MC Shan. Yeah, that was MC Shan. Shantae Roxanne. All right, guys, so this is the first hip hop character, right? This is nice, like, it was done for the culture of hip hop. Hello guys, you ever seen a movie Do the Right Thing, Radio Raheem? That's a big box. Back in the day, as big as your box was, that's who the man was. So. Check this out guys, Dapper Dan. If y'all don't know, Dapper Dan played a big influence in hip hop, so he used to design a lot of the artist clothes. Even to today, man, all of the artists go to him to get customized uh, name brands. This is fire. That's fire Ultra magnetic, yo. Oh, this is dope. I want to touch you. He won't touch you, y'all. It's like a, <laughs> like a, a velvet slash leather. It's nice. Nice. Weed and leather. <laughs> oh, my new living room, y'all. Oh, this is fire. So yeah, pretty, yo. This definitely had the juice. Yo, this is super <laughs> dope, y'all. Nothing put together like this. This is fire, y'all. Hey, yo. Look at the whole entire room. This is lit. Like I said, they do have like headphones and stuff, so you guys can listen to some of the audio in the room, give you a little bit of history about what's going on. Premier. Oh, DJ Premier. I'm about to, 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 I
gonna lie, DJ Premier is mad old school, but every time I hear Premier, I just think of that put 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 Premier, put 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 Premier. So comment down below, guys. Who's your favorite DJ? Who you like, Funk Flex? Out of the Bronx? DJ Premier? Yeah.